I wanted to control a DC motor, with a microcontroller, but I didn't have a relay, so I made one using a servo motor instead. Here we have a DC motor which is rated for 24 volts. To control it with a microcontroller we either need a relay or an H-bridge motor driver IC. But we didn't have those. We use this servo motor which will act as a relay or a switch. It will complete the circuit or break the circuit similar to a relay or a switch. This is a 24 volts relay, it connects its contacts when powered with 24 volts. It can be used to control the motor. But we didn't use it. We also had another relay, which can be controlled by 12 volts but we didn't use that either. This is what, the circuit would have looked like, if we had used a SPDT relay. But we use the servo instead, and now it looks like this. This is the real circuit, here we have a wire attached to the horn of the servo which is extended. When this arm rotates then this wire touches the metal strip, completing the circuit. Arduino Uno will be sending the commands to the servo motor, and all the wiring and connections are done on the breadboard, for quick prototyping. This type of relay can be used to control any device with any voltage, we just have to enclose, and secure this setup, and we also have to take care of the sparks, that get generated while connecting and disconnecting, these sparks damage both the connecting metallic parts. So it is better to use solid state, and transistor based relays or switches like MOSFETs or IGBTs. Let's see the relay in action. That's all for now. See you again with more robotic technologies. Robotics every day.